Hi, I'm Tom Bassett, and in this video, I'm going to demonstrate some use cases using the REST API via Postman. For the purposes of this video, I have already forked the Salesforce Developers Platform APIs collection into my own Postman workspace. To get started, I need to authorize the connection between Salesforce and Postman. Because I'm already logged into Salesforce within another tab, to authorize, I need to press on the authorization tab under Salesforce Platform APIs and then press on Get New Access Token. From here, Salesforce is asking me to grant access, which I'm going to allow, and then I should get returned back into Postman. That's now successful, so I'm going to press on Proceed and I need to grab this instant URL. So I'm copying this onto my clipboard and then I'm pressing use token. For the purposes of this demo, I want to create an S object that is of type account. I am going to pop in my endpoint URL here. And I'm also going to change this so it uses version 57 of the API. And then within the body, I've already adjusted this. So my account is going to be called Tom test one. I'm going to press send. And that should now return the Salesforce ID of the created account. You can now see that I've got that ID, so I'm going to copy this. And I want to delete this record. So now I'm going to put the account in here, the record ID in here. I'm going to switch out the endpoint for my endpoint URL. I'm going to pop in my version here, which is 57.0, and then I'm going to press send. That's now successfully deleted my account because you can see that I press send again and Salesforce is returning to me that the entity is already deleted. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and add any feedback in the comments. Thanks.